What's good? Welcome back, everybody, though. You know. Salutes to everybody in the building. This is going to be a panel show, and I'm going to let all of you brothers come up and kick it with me, build with me. Um, I got this channel open for debates today, but I'm going to be honest. I don't know if we're going to get any, but I'm just trying to see what's out there. Uh, it's Friday, I got time, and I may be going live twice on this channel, and I may go live with Friday Fire on Sit Down with Sanchez later tonight. But I don't know yet, I got to play it by ear. Yeah, I'm just chilling today, man. Um, I really want to sit down with some globe believers and um, have a legitimate, you know, I don't want to yell and turn up and do all that shit. I just want to ask some questions and pick their brains and all that shit. I got some couple of uh, slides and stuff that I wanted to show. But it's irrelevant if there's no debate. So I'm going to be honest with you. It's Friday and I'm on my smoke shit. And I doubt if I get any smoke. So I'm prepared to just have a panel with my peoples and shit, and we can chop it up about whatever. So that's why I named today's title Flat Earth First Globe Earth Debates. Discussions, question answers, all that shit. You know, we ain't just limited to one thing, but yeah, man. This is my baby right here. We used to kick it on flat power all the time, man. And uh, now everybody pretty much be on sit down with Sanchez. We be over there deep on Fridays. But this is sort of a little experiment to see if I can get uh, people back over here. The salutes to everybody that is here, though. I don't like the way that chat look. It looked kind of stretched. Let me, uh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to delete, I'm going to delete that chat for a minute. So, yeah, that, that's what we own today. I may review some videos or whatever just to get something going. You know what I'm saying? Just to get something going. Yeah, sh Welcome, El Bari. How you doing, man? Salutes to you. Uh, all good, all good, um, Sanchez. Um... How you doing today, brother? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm kind of a little bit distracted on the conversation. I'm in the middle of traffic right now. It's fine. Salutes to everybody in the chat, watching the show. Flat motherfucking power, you already know, my brother. Flat power, my brother. Appreciate you for joining, man. Hell yeah. And that was real quick, man. You know what? It was, it was, it was, it was like, uh, it was something telling me, go to YouTube and watch. I was I just had the GPS on on the cell phone and driving and driving. Been driving for like the three past hours, heading to Connecticut right now, right? And I'm in the middle of Georgia or North Carolina somewhere. I don't even know exactly where I am. <laughs> mm. But uh, yeah, something was telling me, yo, open YouTube, open YouTube, check if he's live, check if somebody's live, maybe Bobby or, or Sanchez might be live. I don't want to listen to a show because it's kind of getting boring in here. Yeah, and I opened the <laughs> the, the app right, and, uh -huh. and you was the first thing that popped up, my brother. You was the first thing that popped up on my on my on my timeline in in YouTube, and I had a join. You already know. Yeah, it's going down, yo. I appreciate the energy. Hell yeah, For Cedro real? Cedro Star, what's good, man? What what's good? Yo, if you in the chat room, you got a Facebook or a Twitter. When you share this video. Put on there, flat earthers won't smoke with globe earthers. They calling out globe earthers. We want y'all to instigate this smoke. We want y'all to uh, done one this thing. You know what I'm saying? We want all the smoke. We're we'll ready yeah. for that. I'm going to mute my mic and fall back so, so you can attend the other people. Like, yeah. you know, I'm already in traffic in here. I got to watch this jamming in here, okay? Uh, that's but I'm, 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 I'm willing to participate. Y'all can tell them. You can put on a post, Sanchez said, pull up. Y'all don't want no smoke. He over there talking. Greed. Say he over there talking, y'all. <laughs> Go get him. <laughs> Go get hey, him. What's up, bro, Sanchez? What's good, Daryl? Welcome back, man. Welcome back, yeah, bro. How you doing? Minute, man. 
ain't yeah, I know it's been a minute. It's good to see you, man. <laughs> good to see Yo, you. Yo, man. Here. I I I I you know I you know I've never had no smoke for you, but man, bro, I've been so I've been going on TikTok TikTok right and, and I'm balancing <laughs> yeah. them. I've been balancing them uh, Globers over there, right? Yeah. So for the first time, I seen a, a Glober. She, he was actually flying an airplane. He was a pilot, like he put a live, and he's actually flying the airplane. So I asked him. I said, um, from your standpoint point point of view, uh, Mister Pilot. Uh, is the earth flat? And then, of course, you know what they say. Uh, why would you ask me a question like that? Don't you think you need to go back to school and learn ge geometry? <laughs> right. You see what I'm saying? Like, yeah, man. And, and, it's like, and, 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 and and the thing about geometry, right? If if you really knew about geometry, he would understand that geometry debunks a sphere. It proves a circle. So right. I mean, exactly, exactly. He man, but he did. But I, I, so you know what I ended up saying to him. I said, you know what? I understand. You you can't tell the truth because you're gonna lose your job. So I, I get it. I understand, bro. And then and then he reads it back to you know to his co-pilot, and they like laughed at me, like, oh yeah, sure, right, I'm, yeah, okay. And then he he went on and switched the subject. <laughs> hey. I'm like, wow, man, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, if right. they. They don't really want to debate. They just want to tell you, you didn't pay attention in school. And that's right. what the whole right. purpose of the debate is. So we, we can see who know what. But, right, um, right. But um, let me say shout out to Abdel Rahim. Thank you for the super chat, my brother, as always. And I did mod you up on this channel. I remember you asking me about the wrench. Uh, yeah, I got you, bro. I'm going to march you up on, on the channels, man. Salutes to you, flat motherfucking power. And salutes to Irene Halfledger. Thank you for the super chat donation, guys. Appreciate the love. Yeah. Irene, Irene is a real one. Appreciate that, sis. Hey, what's up, bro? What's good? Who we got, man? That's Cedro in the house. What's good, bro? You got it's it? Good. Yeah, uh, I'm just trying to get like a deeper understanding mm -hmm. about your teachers, right? Because the last time you were saying something about the women on vaginal canal, yeah, and how that's the same thing as like the stairs to heaven, like the levels to heaven, and I'm trying to really take that all in. Pause. Like, are you trying trying to say that we relive inside of a woman's body, or are you trying to say the 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 like the woman body just imitates? What the universe is, or are you trying to say like it's one and like one and the same? They're one and the same, and that syncretism it, it just a practice that I use to decipher symbolism and and things of that nature. It's also a law of the universe, and that's why everything is based upon fractals. All fractals is is that the universe is taking one concept and um. It, and and building everything we see on that foundational principle. So then everything will be the same and different. It's paradoxical in nature. But the thing about the fractal, the more you zoom in, you find the same pattern. The more you zoom out, you find the same pattern. And uh, the reason they call it Mother Earth is because the Earth is built on, I mean, you got to think about it. The Earth has to give birth to things every day, flowers, plants. Uh, the earth literally acts as a mother. How uh, as it? That's why we the word nature literally comes from the word nurture. Nature, nurture. So, um, the thing about what you asking me? Shout out, Marcel. Welcome back, man. Big, much love to, to you, bro. Hell yeah. Good to see you. Um, but yeah, like uh, that's what I was saying is that. They call it Mother Earth for a reason. They say Mother Earth and Father Time. But the Earth is literally uh, built on the same principles of the female reproductive system, for sure. That's what I was saying. Shout out to Ram Richard. Black motherfucking power. Appreciate the love, y'all. All right, so I want to follow up with this question. Um, So, um... How many people that listen to you day in, day out, do you think, like, 
give me like a percentage wise that really understand what you mean by like the fractal. Because like I think again, I understand. My bad. My like, bad you hear me? One more time, one more time. I, I said out of all the people that like watch you day in and day out, right? How many people do you think um truly understand about the fractal thing that you're saying? Because I think I understand. And um I think that if you understand the fractal, I feel like you just get it. Like it's like it's like it's no way like then it's gonna get to a point where like you just gonna just be learning from everything. Like everything gonna start to make sense. Mm -hmm. Like everything about life. So how many people do you think like give me like a percentage, like fifty percent in the world? Truly, no, not in the world. People that listen to to well, you can say the world too next. That's another question. But as far as people that follow you, that listen to you day in and day out. How many people do you think that get it yet? Because I know they entwine, like they into it. I, I how never many people thought do you about think? it. Yeah, I never thought about that. Because I'm asking you, bro, because one time I was on your show and you had said said something. And then I was like, yeah, yeah, bro, I get it. And then I broke it down. And then you said, yo, if you truly get what I'm saying, like, like you special, because not a lot of people really, really get it. Well, yet, I know but... it ain't a lot. That's the damn show. We can say that with no uh, hesitation. But, uh, okay, you want me to give you a number, and I'm going to go ahead and do it. I'm going to go ahead and do it. I would say I'm going to give you a percentage, because I know that's what you're looking for. So um, out of the people that listen to me, i say probably 30% get it on the real level that I'm getting it on, and then 50% they get it, but they, they, they get it enough to teach it too. And then the rest of them is kind of, they get it, but they don't get it, I guess. I don't know if that's right or not, because most people that follow me, they understand the flat earth thing. Hey, water don't curve, the earth ain't spinning. But when I go into like the ancient cosmology, the life of out the death, all that stuff, that's when, you know, because you can still have Christians and Muslims that saying the earth is flat. And so when you go into ancient cosmology and what they were saying about the flat earth, you'll still have flat earthers that'll say, well, look now, the earth is flat, but I don't know about all that other stuff you teaching, bro Sanchez. I rock with you because you proven that it's flat, you know, but I don't, you know, but you know, then the ancient cosmology, they, they, you know, it's a lot of people that's like that with me. They will support me, but they just with the flat earth shit and not because, the ancient bro, like, yeah. Because bro, like, you know, like when like the round earth is how like, they be like, okay, how is the earth flat? When the um the luminaries and stuff in the sky is around, the sun is around, the moon is around. I think they kind of get into the fractal code, but they not getting it right. Cause I understand what they mean by that. Cause if the Earth is, cause they trying to get to the fractal code, but they don't really understand what it is. Like the first thing you taught me when I started understanding it truly is when you was talking about like when you like pour sugar, and then I automatically go into the shape of like the pyramid. Mm hmm. Like it took mm -hmm. took took me a while to think about it, but yeah, you saw this is crazy about the mushroom clouds and all that, like the fractal code, like the explosion, like it's yeah. crazy, man. And that's all it is. Um, I just say life is an explosion, and it's really deep when you start looking at the sacred geometry behind it. But a hey, shout out to everybody on here, man. Any questions y'all got? Yeah, Cedro. Yeah, a bomb away, man. Here we, you know, I got the slides ready. If the globalists show up, we can get the smoke going. However, y'all want to do it. Yeah, and just, and just like you were saying about the nose, about how like your nose, that little like dent, like on top of your upper lip, and then your nose is like the mushroom cloud, is the explosion. Mm hmm. Yep. Yeah. And, you and then like see, the same thing with the afros. And, hey, shout out to Al. My brother Abdel Rahim, man, shout out for that love, my brother. Y'all showing much love with the uh, super chats. D. Allen Warren, shout out to you, my brother. Flat motherfucking power, man. Hell yeah, I and, appreciate you. And, and then, bro, another thing, right? You remember, yeah. all right, like with Madden, you remember that? Um, do you play Madden? I, I I have played it, but you know I'm. A, oh yeah, I'm a, I know all about Madden. But yeah, the old school one, the old old school one, the one with the QB vision. Well, you know, I, my memory bad too, but I do remember Madden though. But go yeah, ahead. Yeah, but they had one when like the QB had like the QB vision. 
and it's like a triangle. It's like a triangle. It's like the division. It's like basically it made me think about the flat to co about how you were saying about the projection, because because like the projection is coming out is and 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 like a triangle form, right? Um, the like the light, the, the like the projection of the light is coming out. Okay, like yeah, I got you. Form. I got you for sure. I got you. Yeah. Yeah, but I always just wanted to bring that up too about the QB vision. Like you can just look back at that later. I like the graphics I, of it. I, I know what you're talking about, and wherever you looked, it'll light up that part with a. Yeah, yeah I, I, I remember now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, Man, but I don't want to hold up the mic. But I mean, just want to spark it up. That, that yeah, brings yeah. memories and salute, bro. Salutes, salute, awakening, much love, my brother. Appreciate much you for joining, man. Bro. Appreciate all y'all hey, brothers um, for joining. That Madden shit, bro, that memories, man. Everywhere you I used to turn Peyton Manning head, you know, you get the, the triangle, the reflection. But um, bro, I don't know if you um I don't know if you ever brought this up though on the um, distant time and speed. It's pretty much what governs mathematics, you know what I'm saying? Like DTS. If you can pull that triangle up, and it's also a triangle, um, Fredro, what, what's, what's the dude's name? Cedro Star. Yes, Cedro Star. Ooh, just, yeah, you made me, you, when you talk, start talking about the fractal code, it's so crazy how it's always in the triangle, too. You know what I'm saying? There you go, bro. So, like, if you cover up the D, which is trying to find distance, it leave the S and the T, which is speed times time. You know what I'm saying? If you're trying to figure out the speed from any two points, it's now distance divided by time. You know, if you're trying to find time, it's now distance divided by speed. But you see how everything is still in that fractal code, that triangle. And this this right here, this is very, very important. You know, this is the type of shit I would teach my kids right away. That's deep. Mm -hmm. But look at Mama Maru, you know? Hmm. This is pretty interesting here. Flat power, everybody. Flat power. Yeah. Flat power, my brother. Hell yeah. Today a big day for me, everybody. Word you know, up. This shit right here. This shit right here. It debunks a globe. You know what I'm saying? You can't have none of this in space. You know what I'm saying? None of it. And it brings you back to the flat core, the, the, the earth, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, hey, yo, man. Sanchez. Uh huh. I wanted to add on to that too. Yo, my bad, bro. Go ahead, brother. You was first. My bad. I I'm sorry. Uh, Sanchez, quick questions. Do you have um Steam in your computer? You know the application for games for computer games. I don't. Oh, I don't know if I have. What? Which say Steam? Yeah, S T E A M. Steam. Okay, uh, no, I have another uh, gaming. Uh, uh, when yeah. you when you can download Steam, open your account, and there's a, a flat Earth map in there that's 3D, and you can move the map around and show the the openings on the south south uh, ring. Some serious yeah. shit, brother. <laughs> You're gonna have to check that out, man. Real talk. Yeah. Hey, for because, real. Hey, what, you can, yeah. thank, you can hey, pull it thank up. You, thank you, Daryl. Shout out to my brother Daryl for the super chat for sure. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, bro, Sanchez, I wanted to add up to that too. Uh, what my awakening mind was saying, because it's crazy. Like, I put a, a, a link on the chat where you can see pyramids, right? And then you can see them reflected from a mirage, like uh, from the water. And then it makes a diamond. And I remember you was talking about. Back in the days, how the earth in the middle and the center, it, it exhale and ex inhale and exhale like a diamond and an X. You know what I'm saying? So is that shit is really, yeah. really deep because it's a, it could be a reflection of of another uh, of a, the the opposite. You know what I'm saying? Like what he was talk what he was talking about with dimensions and stuff. The other triangle could be the opposite of it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you can only see it with the mirage. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, reflected on water or like a mirage. Hey, shout out to everybody in the chat room. I see y'all. Sister Katrina in the house. Sharon Williams. Yes, this is officially Flat Power TV channel from Bro Sanchez. Salutes to the chat room. Bone Slave. 
Bone Slave. This is your day, Bone Slave. The link to join the call is pinned to the top of the chat, and I'm going to put it out in the chat room now. Bone Slave, if you want to come up and show how the flat earth model doesn't work, we will be uh, very glad to hear you out and give you the mic and let you do your thing. I don't think you're going to do it, Bone Slave. You know, I think if you did, it'll really be a good look for the globe side, though. But if you don't, it's just keep proving our point that, hey, man, what am I to think if people scared to come up and debate me? I'm going to say, hey, we right about it. Y'all wrong. and You scared. Yeah, that's the only thing. Shout out to Troopy, man. What's good? I see you, bro. Shout out to everybody on the call, man. Yeah. What's good? What you saying, Chaz, nigga? What's going on with you? Much love, bro. Um, I'm trying to get them up, man. I may have to start pan globalist the motherfucking come up, man. I don't know. This is getting crazy. What up, everybody? Oh, uh, if I had a chance to uh, come on, if, if I don't want to interrupt nobody. No, you good. Uh, today a big day for me. Uh, I've been waiting to come across a little issues in my life and feel like I came across some and uh get to get my Patreon today so I get Hell the information yeah, man. and uh make sure I'm uh got my ancestral ancestral weapons together as I'm part of the infantry as we get ready for war, bro. So uh, much love to you in the body. Always standing firm, bro. Much love and respect, my brother Marcel, as always. And I appreciate your support, man. Real talk. I appreciate well, you know, everything y'all do. I, I, yeah, man, for sure, bro. And it's all about you, bro. I appreciate it's all It's all about you. the com this y'all, man, the whole community, real talk. Yeah. Like yeah, real talk. I wouldn't be shit without y'all support for real, man. Everybody uh help a little in it, you know what I'm saying? Keep this shit going. And um, they yes, ain't going to be able to blackball us, bro. This shit is growing, man. The week, I'm yeah, telling you. Been a journey, bro. I tell you, bro. Been a hell of a journey. Uh, for being, uh, having times we had no one to talk to about information. And now the world is afraid of the information. <laughs> it's uh, mm. pretty exciting. Pretty exciting. Yeah, man. You got that right. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm tripping. Uh. I'm tripping though off uh somebody said Chrome TV was talking about me. And if he was, it was in a good light, I'm sure. Because uh yeah, man, him ain't got no problems. So whoever's coming with that, we'll we'll see about it, man. We'll see what's up. I tell you what, bro. I tell you, man. Much, much respect, bro. I tell you, uh, from the outside looking in, from the inside looking out. You know, I've been on both sides, and uh, man, you are really a force to be reckoned with. I see why they're afraid, bro. There ain't nobody gonna step on your toes. They're not gonna lie to you on a on a on a major platform. Anyone at this point, we we do understand that. But I think that your safety and your knowledge that you have for us as a body, uh, it, it make us sacrificial for this flat movement. And I'm so proud to be a part of it. And I appreciate y'all. The young words can even imagine. That's why I let y'all know all the time. Sure. Yeah, we ain't, we, you know, it's, it's communities that's, like I said, Way bigger than this shit. But hey, yeah. man, the, the the truth is to spew the fucking proud like the Marines. But let let me quit. I'm I'm really yeah. I'm really like sidetracked. I ain't gonna lie because now that he got me all interested in seeing what Crom TV is saying, but I ain't gonna. I might not even respond, man. I've been on some positive shit, man. Man, I'm falling back, man. Do your thing, man. They won't smoke. Give them smoke, bro. I mean, it's yeah, all good. Yeah. We, we, yeah, we, we, so. we with it. We with it all, bro. However you want to approach it, bro. I'm just going to fall back, man. Much love, bro, bro. No, much love, bro. You good? Hey, yeah. hey bro. Bro, Sanchez, did, did, uh, did, did you did you get me on the, uh, the, the Super Chat? Yeah, I, I shouted you out too, man. I appreciate the love, Dara, as always. You know, you're you're day one, been 
support. Yeah. I appreciate it, man. Hell yeah. Yeah, re- reason why I hear it because I got I, I for some reason every now and then I get I get kicked off of there. I don't, I don't know yeah. why I get kicked off. I noticed that. that. I said, "What the hell?" He Daryl just uh, <laughs> left and sent the super chat. Yeah, 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 yeah man. Yeah, no doubt, man. You you definitely deserve it, man. No, no, I, no, I appreciate no you, you, man. I don't, don't take doubt. y'all support for granted, neither, man. I humbly appreciate no y'all. Yeah. Peace. Well, man, uh, yeah, yeah. I don't know, man. Maybe should you go check that check that bro out. That uh, what, what'd you say his name was? But Crumb TV. Yeah, Crumb TV. Yeah. Because the thing is, I would definitely uh, I would. De- oh, okay. So he over there. Oh, right. Yeah, I'm. A, I think I'm gonna have to respond to him. <laughs> yeah, he Uh-oh. got. He he. Don't get him. Don't, yeah. Don't get him. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to get him. I might. Ha- I'm gonna have to get him. I think yep. I might have to go live on sit down with Sanchez and get him, and you know. Oh, okay. It's fun that way, but I ain't gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this show going. I'll get him. Uh, but he he uh, he a global. I, I never heard of him before. He a global or something or. Uh, no, nah, he he actually just a brother with a channel that invite people on to uh to do their little things, and he invited me on. It was a fire show. I never had problems with him. But what happened oh. was recently. I was going in on Nature Boy, and uh, I was congratulating the fact that Nature Boy in jail. I was kind of mocking Nature Boy, and uh, people was like, hey, bro, Sanchez, you know Crumb TV rocks with Nature Boy. Like, he, 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 oh. uh, he's like a student of Nature Boy and shit. And I was right. like, well, and, and, and like, dude was trying to make it look like I'm a hypocrite. So I was like, look, Crumb TV, my nigga, but if he rock with Nature Boy, I don't rock with him no more. Right, right. That's right. all I said. So I guess he took that, like, I don't know how that was a disrespect unless he's saying, well, I do rock with Nature Boy. And you saying you don't want to fuck with me because I fuck with Nature Boy? Like, that's the only thing he can really say other than that. I don't know, but I might go live and and and, and address him later on today or tomorrow. One yeah. or the other. Shout out to G Man One Hundred. Appreciate the love. Real talk. Flat power. He said, "Hey, bro, keep the big info coming. Love this community. Appreciate that." Hell yeah. Mm. It's a place called Flat Earth Pizza out here in Nevada. <laughs> Flat Earth Pizza. That's your that's your slab though. I never I haven't had it yet, but they designed their pizzas to make it look like the flat earth. And uh it, it ain't in Vegas though, it's like upstate and shit. But oh, I should, no. yeah. I'll show it by that shit. <laughs> yeah. It's growing, man. Uh, See it more and more. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's a good idea right there though. Like For real. Yeah. Yeah, they ain't they ain't gonna come this cause the fire that on why rocket why they say rocket go thirty five thousand miles an hour? They ain't gonna man. they ain't gonna do that, man. They gonna come over here. You know what I'm saying? They gonna they ain't gonna come over here and 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 clarify why the fuck they can circumnavigate the Earth completely from one point to another, no, bro. It's not gonna but, happen. But the people I've been fuck with, man, they they say they have proved it. I'm like. And they showed this video with an airplane flying, but I was like, "Dude, you did not show the airplane circumnavigating the Earth." What? what I mean, I mean, yeah, it's a jet and everything, but you know, show the whole video. They they, they can't do it. Yeah. They can't never do this. Can't. That that's the official flat Earth pizza. I'm guessing. You know, the faux faux um, what you call faux Mercator joints. And then Ooh, good too. this one right here is like, I mean, it, it's just, it's just the idea, you know what I'm saying? It's it's right. dope, it's a good it idea. It's cool though. It look good though. Yeah. Now that green one, I, I don't I got, know about that one. Now. <laughs> yeah. I got to go and go and check them out. I'm gonna have to eat the green one too, and the uh, cause them the main two flat Earth pizzas. This one and uh, that one. Yeah. <laughs> 
Where's the good? Good thing on the the pizza, man. I'm a hot. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing will be to do a live streaming from there while you eat the pizza and everything. That would be that would be dope as fuck. That would be dope. That would be dope. Yeah. I am. The man, the man, the man, flat earth teacher on YouTube eating pizza in Nevada. Flat earth pizza. Oh my gosh, that beat is gonna blow the internet, bro. Bro, bro, look at they look. Look at they logo, bro. And they symbolic too. You know, you see that logo? Man, this yeah. was a good idea, man. I swear, you right, bro. Like I got <laughs> to go and holler at them and and, and you know and damn. Yeah, if it is spo- if it is sponsorship for the trip, let me know. <laughs> yeah, right, 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 yeah right. you know. You know, I'm I'm hot to go and holler and like, look, I can sponsor this, man. You know, I'm 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 that guy for the flat earth, you know. Right. Yeah, you yeah. should call them now from the stream. <laughs> Yo, for right. real. Yeah, Yo, for right. real. Yeah. Call it right now. But the pizza really looks good, though. Like, I bet you the globe earthers be eating in this motherfucker, too. Like, hey, I know what it's called, but shit, you know, it's good. You know. I'm like, yeah. it's flat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I just want to know what that green, what that green on that pizza is, man. I don't know what that is, man. That's that, that's that spinach artichoke, nigga. Uh, yeah. I can't fuck with that, dude. Some food coloring <laughs> and shit. That's black. Spices. See, see what, yeah. um, yeah, I, I, I know getting a little corny here, but with the Pizza Hut joint, man, I get the meat lovers, man. I, I, I let my pepperoni, sausage, and you know, all that, like, like all that. But man, I don't, I don't know about the artichoke thing. <laughs> hey, shout out to Rom Ham Solo. Welcome to the channel membership, bro. I appreciate that flat motherfucking power. Yo. Hey, 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 you see that video? Uh, the nigga that they put the Neuralink chip in actually playing, playing chess and shit for the first time. Oh, shit. Playing chess? Playing chess with the Neuralink. Yeah, he. I guess he's like a quadruple. He can't use his hands or his legs, nigga. And they got him on there playing chess, bro. Yeah. So so he walking yeah, He walking man. and everything and all that now? Not yet. I mean, they ain't got him walking, but he in a chair like Stephen Hawking playing chess, though. You know? Oh, shit. God damn. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. About it changed his life and shit, and there's more improvements to come. You know, this right, is just the we... beginning type shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, here we go. All right, boy, boy. Okay, what the future about to bring? Hmm. Hmm. Mm. I'm yeah. I'm actually looking that up now. And it's the actual video of it. It's a, it's a, I'm, I'm, seeing, I'm gonna see if I can look it back up. Cause I just seen it like two days ago. I had the article and everything. A minute, 30 seconds. Yeah, it ain't long at all. Yeah, it ain't long yeah, at all. That's from the Guardian, I think. This the one. My name's Nolan Arbaugh. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's hot, yeah, using the force. Yeah, that's um, it, yeah. Yeah, there um, you years go. Years ago, I was in kind of a freak diving accident and uh, dislocated my C4-C5, so I'm a complete um, quadriplegic, uh, so I'm paralyzed from below the shoulders. I love playing chess, and so this is one of the things that y'all have enabled me to do, something that I wasn't able to really do much the last few years, especially not like this. Um, I had to use like a mouse stick and stuff, but now it's all... Uh, it's all being done with my brain. If y'all can see the cursor moving around the screen, that's that's all me, y'all. Um, it's pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Actually, can you pause this on just for the yeah, audio absolutely. coming through? And that was also done with your brain? Yep. <laughs> it's all brain power up there. So yeah, man, the cyborgs are here. So a lot of what we started out with was Whoa. attempting to move. So I would attempt to move, say, my right hand, left, right. I think it just became intuitive for me to start imagining the cursor moving. Um, basically, it was like uh, using the force on a <laughs> cursor and I could get it to move wherever I wanted, just stare somewhere. In so think about the IOT, the internet of things. If everything hooked up to the internet, the people with the Neuralink chip in their head can literally control your ass too, cause you're the wet. You're like, 
You make and hack your ass. The screen and oh, oh, move my God. What I wanted to. Like you said uh, the last time, it, press a button, slap the fish, <laughs> slap his face. <laughs> you, know me, you know what it reminds me of? Y'all remember that? It was a toy they came out with when we was when I was a kid. I know y'all, y'all know, I know y'all like 10, maybe 15 years older than me, but uh it was a toy they came out with where they where they, you had to like strap a headband on and it was like a little blue ball, and your thoughts actually made the ball go into the hoop. They had commercials for it. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, I know you're talking about, it, yeah. It kind of yeah. remind me of that, but like, it was, it was like they've been doing this shit, but now instead of just being like, and I, like you said, they used to have a little, the little head hats that could like do the same shit as this nigga doing, but now it's like a computer chip. Mm. They think they, I don't know. That's crazy. Let me, let me give a shout out to wise, humble one. Love, bro. Flat motherfucking power. Appreciate that, man. Hell yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to see, like, was... I think I remember what you saying, Troopy, but then again, it's very vague. There's too many blunts ago, but you put it on your head and you able to have, have these same capabilities? Yeah, but it was like a... It was a... All right, it was like a little... It was almost like a little ping pong ball or some shit. Yeah, and, right. Uh, on a little table type shit with like little bat with like two little basketball hoop type things and the kid would put it on their head and they would make the ball, you know what I mean, like telekinesis type shit jump in the hoop. You know what I mean? I forget the name of the toy. I need to look it I, up, bro. I, mm, I, talk, I need yeah, to look because it yeah. was a thing, bro, mm. like back in right, the early two thousands, right. late nineties, nigga. It's not it's, Damn. Like, it's a thing, bro. Like Somebody's saying they calling this cap right here. This ain't real. This 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 uh this clip we playing. I'ma just say this. Neuralink is real, people. Welcome to the future. This is no game. It ain't no cap. Neuralink is real. And the uh science behind the technology is very uh under I, I can I, I get it. You know, if you understand what how the technology works. It ain't nothing that's out of the realm of possibility. If there's any globe earthers or anybody in the chat room that got questions about Flat Earth, I'm going to, uh, you know, recommend that you click the call link and come on and chill with us. We won't bite, you know. Man, I want some smoke. Where the smoke at? That's what I'm saying, man. It's, I guess it's just going to be all in my lungs today, my brother, Retton. The smoke going to be in Peace, man. Yeah, yeah peace, right. my brother. Welcome back. Peace, man. Yep. Matter of fact, if the, the global if the global is joined, you will be debating, uh, retina debate y'all, because uh, I don't know what y'all intimidated by me or something or what. We just want the smoke, man. Um, I got questions. I don't even got debates. Yeah, they should, man. Tell them they, they got to get through me to get to you, man. Yeah, man. We'll do them like that today. Shout out to you, OG Dean General. What? Welcome back. Yeah, that's how we'll do it, man. But I may need to, somebody keep telling me because, you know, I know there's a lot of globe birthers on Twitch and fucking these other Liberty platforms. What I'm going to do, I'm going to get some people that's fucking around with them other platforms when we go live over here for debates and they'll have, maybe they can bring them over here. Maybe I need to get me a damn Twitch now for these debates. They're deep on Discord. They yeah, Discord is what I meant. Discord. That's the one I meant, right in this Discord. I said Twitch. That's where they at. Jim Panda and all them over there. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be like 500 people on the call. Them boys be deep as hell. Yeah, that's the, the Discord lets you have so too many people on the call. That's like the clubhouse. Yeah, we deep on the call today. Salutes to everybody on the call, man. And yeah, okay. we, you know, even if they don't show up, we 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 holding it down. Um, hold yeah, on, I, I got. I, I, oh my, you found it. We'll pull it up. Y'all yeah. wanna? Y'all want? Y'all want, want to smoke with Rob, yo? Yeah, I ain't heard Rob in a long time. Yeah, let's get him. Yeah, let that nigga on, man. <laughs> man, we want to smoke with everybody, man. Brain. Okay, for sure. that, brain. That's what's up. Flat power to that. What's the name of it, Troopy? Come on up, Rob. It's called Mind Flex, man. Mind Flex. One mind word. Flex. Yeah, that's it. Oh, one word. Oh, 
Oh, it's all, yeah, that's it. That's it right this there. This shit right here. Right Man, yeah, mm -hmm. that came out when I was a kid, bro. And they was advertising. All right, you that's it, dude. On your head what the and make fuck? The ball jump in the hoop. Yeah, right. get the fuck. Hold up, yeah, bro. bro. Yeah. <laughs> so Neuralink, this is based on Neuralink technology, y'all. Right. Facts, brainwave, radio so, wave technology, nigga. So he ain't t gotta touch that ball. He just thinking it a certain way, and it's what's yeah, it's supposed it was, to make it move the ball. It's supposed to make it move the ball. I yeah. ain't never had one, but I just seen it advertised. I on might TV, get and one. I always too. wanted one. I used to be like, damn, I want to move shit with my mind. I ain't, but I ain't never got one. <laughs> That's what he's saying. Mind flex. That's what they selling it like, bro. I might get one. They still um selling them. Yeah. How much are they? Yeah. They ain't even that much, nigga. I might get one of these today. Ah, uh, I'm gonna feel like I got the mark of the beast in my head when I play this <laughs> shit. <laughs> hey, I think that was a YouTube video he was on too, bro. They might show a little clip of it. Oh, man. Oh, this right here? Okay. Yo, I man, swear you was... can't move nothing with your mind unless it's, 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 it's fucking with the... The part that's intent, I can show you the part of the brain, yo, it's crazy. Show you see how Vegas, old that is, too? You can tell by the video YouTube? quality. Mattel, man. Mattel, bro. I'm going to have to play this. Fuck the copyrights. We got to play this. <laughs> I'm going to just speed it up. Maybe that'll get me out, uh, going. Hi there, I'm Daniel Seberg at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, and I'm joined right now by Tim Sheridan from Mattel. Uh, Tim, this is some pretty fascinating technology. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's almost mind over matter in some ways. In an almost every way, okay. actually. <laughs> it's called the Mind Flex. Yeah. Now, it's designed to use your brain waves to control the game. Tell me how this works. That's the part I needed to hear. It's mm -hmm. this, see, now you gotta ask them, what are brain waves? And if my brain waves can interact with physical mechanisms, what else can they do? What else are they? Bro, this is fucking cr Now I got to take this video and, 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 and I got to holler at this. Exactly. Movie. The object of the game is to move a ball through an obstacle course. And you do that uh, not like I just did with my hands, but uh, using the power of your mind. And that's where this headset comes in. This, do you, this is Neuralink. This is fuck, bro. <laughs> this yeah, is Neuralink, yeah. man. Yeah. It has three different sensors on it. I'm going to go ahead and put it on. Okay. This is fucking One sensor gonna your forehead and two uh, clip onto your earlobes like this. Now, what this is going to do is it's going to read my level of concentration. Okay. And that's what's going to impact the game. Now, so we need to tell people a few more things here. Like, there's sure. a little, there's a fan in here, right? That's going to be powered right. by your brain. Waves. Right. I, I'm not a magician. I can't actually levitate the ball. As much as you exactly. Right. But uh, what I can do is, with my mind, control the speed of a little fan that's underneath uh, the ball in the unit there. And uh, the, the more I focus, the more I concentrate, it's already, it's already starting, yep. uh, uh, the higher the ball is going to go, the faster that fan is going to go. Okay. And then you're going to be turning, well, you can turn this knob to get that other axis of it going around. Exactly. Okay. I'm going to exactly. let you demonstrate it here. Okay. Excellent. So let's... So you start a from a resting position. position. And you can, um, you can customize this obstacle course, we should tell people, right? Absolutely. It have to stay like yeah. that. Yeah, it's going to come with a, a bunch of different obstacles, and you can customize hundreds of different ways to, uh, to move through the course. Now, I'm focusing. I'm concentrating. I'm talking to you, yes, but right. I'm still able to focus. That's, that's a, does, it's a, it's a neat trick. Does practice make perfect with this? I mean, if you keep it does. Doing it, it's it does. Easier. It's not immediately intuitive, because what you're doing is you're teaching yourself something brand new. You're teaching yourself how to move an object with your mind. I think um, you told me it was like mind-eye coordination. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not to... like hand-eye coordination. It's mind-eye coordination, which, you know, you've never never had before. Right. Um, as you can see right now, my focus level is nil. I'm not focusing at all while I'm talking to you, which may or may not be a good thing. <laughs> but you saw that the ball fell uh, to the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and, and see if I can bring it back down again. Here we okay, go. Ready? Yeah. Wow. Here we go. No strings attached. Right. All right, Tim Sheridan from Mattel. Thank you so much. Thanks, That's another Eye on Technology for CBSNews.com. This is crazy, man. Um. Yeah, yeah Eye on Technology. Wow. Yeah, bro. What's your, and now, now, now we need to look up the definition of brainwave. What by definition are y'all talking about? Because you know when you tell when you tell scientists that the human brain that we got the power to have telepathy and all that shit that was that was suit that's still pseudoscience today. I can't make this up. T telepathy, right? which is, uh, you know, controlling shit with your brain waves or brain power and shit. Mm -hmm. To this day, that's still considered pseudoscience, even though Neuralink is here and they had toys like this back in the 80s. Yeah, that's crazy. Yep. 
they damn sure did, man. This all this technology is old, man. These people been they've been having this shit since Atlantis, man. This is facts, man. Like, that's why I'm not that surprised, but I am like, damn, nigga. This is and if they did this in the eights, okay, here's what. So again, like the third eye is where this brain wave coming from. That's where they say you would have a mark of the B set right there on the forehead right there. So it, it's, well, it's a form, mm -hmm. yeah. What was the name of the company? Eon Technologies? That was the name of them. Yeah, it was made by Mattel. Yeah, that's who Mattel, it was. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, oh, I, th nah, I thought nah, he said. They will definitely have sub subsidiaries, you know, so you might find what you're looking for. Okay. Yeah. Crazy, man. That is wow. crazy. That back in the day, they was fucking with shit like that. But see, back <laughs> then, we would just play with the toy, and we didn't understand how it worked, but we was just having fun. We weren't thinking about, whoa, what about the third eye, the pineal gland, and all this stuff. You see what I'm saying? Hell yeah. It's so crazy, because it's like the third hand as well, bro. You wouldn't even need controllers. It's like it Mattel really and Nintendo. It's like Nintendo and Sega and all of them. They couldn't get together because that that should have been the future, you know, as far as playing without your hands and shit like that, using the mind, mind over matter, which is one zero one, which goes back to binary. That yeah. secondary <laughs> um definition, bro. That secondary definition you had up when you was looking at brainwave. If you can pull pull that one back up again, just the definition, but right below it, it, it showed you, you know, like what thoughts are, what brand new ideas are. It's like a connecting point. You know, each human being is a server, man, to compute Earth correctly, mm -hmm. you know. But if you look at that secondary definition, you see what I mean. For example, when you say, aha, I see. I get it, you know, like I see, I see, I see, I see is Isis, you know, Hathor, that's saying, I understand. Even the African traditions, they say, I say, I say, you know, it's the connection point, you know what I'm saying? But I'm glad you brought up the definition of brain waves to so really go deep on that shit. Hey, when he said that people could get hacked earlier, that shit struck a chord with me, man, because I feel like I've been hacked. And I'm Air Force, I'm ex-Air Force, and I feel like DOD been playing with me with this, this same technology. Hey, mm. guess guess what What about this hack shit, bro? <laughs> hey, sh shout out to uh, Brandon Prather, Flat Power. Thank you so much for your support. Yo, what if our lower self has already been hacked by our higher self in other right. words you see what i'm saying so we think everything we doing is just our free will but what if you just an avatar in a video game and somebody got a controller d controlling your every move right now and you thinking that is you doing it now look and we the one that's controlling this character we call it the higher self or the guide the god the one guiding the mm -hmm. avatar through the game that's the mind mm -hmm. over the matter, right? Now watch this. Um, I watched a video yesterday. This dude got millions of views on this. He was playing this advanced AI game, a simulation game. I don't know the name of it, but um, he was going up to the AI in the game telling them, look, you're just AI and you're in the game. And I was really impressed by this game because it got a lot like it really feel like the real world. People ain't it's feel like like each human in the game is like a chat GPT AI. So it's like you can really get lost in just an endless real like conversation with different responses. And but the thing is, he was telling all the people in the game, he was like, you know that you're not real, right? You're in a simulation and that he was walking up to the NPCs trying to, I may find that video, man. When I was watching that video, it, that. it blew me away, bro. I, it blew I, I me away. That, bro, right it blew, that. man, that shit blew me away, bro. Cause the, how they was right. responding, like how we would respond if we was in a right. video game, you know what I'm saying? They respond how people respond to you when you try to tell them right now, like, bro, yeah. what are you talking about? You know yeah. What I mean? it's, like, it's like, damn. You remember the part you was talking about beyond the wall, remember? 
He was asking that AI, like, what do you think is be like beyond like the wall? Yeah, man. Yeah, that bro. Funny. That's exactly what he and and it, then it was crazy how when he was trying to ask all What's of the, he was trying to ask all of the AI like how do I get behind the wall? And they was acting dumb and shit. Like, what you talking about? Like, what? And <laughs> like, this reminded me of the Truman Show when he was like, when he was, they, everybody playing dumb when you try to talk right. about going off the map and shit. You know, damn, bro. This is this was a dope experiment right here, man. And I don't know what the name of this game is. That's Grand Theft. If this Grand Theft, they didn't really nah, step in. Oh. Assimilation. Yeah. They made a movie called Free. Damn, no, I ain't gonna lie. This make me want to get back gaming. Goddamn, this is kind of dope. Yeah. <laughs> no, they were saying though, if they intertwine this with GTA, it'll be crazy. Wow. I'm telling you, it'll be man. But this was a I mean, crazy. Vice, Vice City's yeah. coming in 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 2025. So, and they say they're gonna put more advanced. Uh, you know, features inside the NPCs and everything to not make them similar to GTA 5, but it's going to be a step further or two, three step further on GTA 6. I'm expecting that one to drop, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry. Damn, I knew when no global is going to show up. This is fucking crazy. <laughs> they get don't want no smoke, man. <clears throat> they don't want none, man. Yo, um, Sanchez, you, um, you and um, you and Craig still cool? Bro, Sanchez. Oh, he must he must step out. Hey Daryl, I see you on um, your your profile picture there. What you showing the compulsory raise? I see you showing yeah, you the, that? You the know rising. You know what I'm yeah, there? That's a nice picture. Oh, the yeah. corpuscle, right. the corpuscle array, yeah. That's right. What up, what up, what up, what up, panel? What up with everybody? What up, awakening man? What's up, man? What it is, man. What's, What's up, up family? Got it. I'm the southern coast of Mississippi, man. Chilling. Yeah. Um, I, I don't know if y'all heard me earlier. Um, I went on TikTok. I gotta make sure. I I gotta make sure I said the word TikTok because somebody in the chat said I said Tic Tac. <laughs> I'm, I'm old school. No, but um, so this guy did a live. He he he's a he's a pilot, right? And he did a live, right? And I I just asked him a simple question. I said, "Yo, is the Earth flat? Why since you flying? I mean, is the Earth flat?" And of course, he went and said, "Uh, he really asked me that. Is the Earth flat? Um, I think he needs to go back and learn geometry. I mean, I mean that's that's third grade stuff." And I was like, "Okay." I said, I bet you, I bet you land on some flat land. Wow, yo, he did, yo, he he did, he didn't even want to die before, man. Oh, you can't, yeah. you can't hey. the whole suburb. Hey, check this out, Daryl. I, I used to put on fuel on airplanes here in Atlanta, right? Okay. And right. so, you know, I've talked to a lot of pilots. This is what sparked my journey too, you know, on flat Earth as well as other syncretisms. But mm. I used to sell them. I used to, so I used to work, I used to put fuel on the airplane and I used to work at Sunglass Hut there in the airport, you know? So I used right. to sell the pilots, these, they make special sunglasses right. for them. They're called Serengetis. So you right. see like how your picture there, you can see the, the compulsory rays. It just shows you how close earth is. I mean, the sun is the earth. It's within our atmosphere. This is one right. of the reason why all the pilots wear Shut Serengetis sunglasses you know because once you get right. above the clouds it's like layers you know what i'm saying within the atmosphere right, exactly. and they teach us this 
you know, but it, it's so crazy that you had brought that the pilot said, what, 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 you need to go back to school? Like, they know this shit, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, and I'm like you're you know, looking, you're flying. You're literally flying. Where do you see the dip? Where's the curve? Like, man, I, I man. What, how, you, how, do, how, do, how do they deal with a periscope, though, bro? I just want to see the grounds they stand on when you deal with a periscope. That's gonna See, be pretty. The way the way Globers look at how why is the globe the way they look at it, and the reason why they always say oh because it's so big. So I understand what they're saying. So what they're saying is if you was to fly up, like if you was to fly up and, and come outside of Earth, and then if you was to see somebody walking or driving or whatever, it would look like a little ant, and and, and you'd be moving like inches on uh, inches, even though you, even though a yeah, car but, you know, can drive yeah, like yeah. whatever sixty miles per hour, whatever. But it looked like it's moving an inch by inch. But I told him, I said, okay, I understand all that. So let's just say, let's just say this hypothetically. I just want to know where is the dip at? Where, where, when is, when is it going to start curving down, down, down until you get to the point where you get it upside down? You know, even if it take you thirty thousand years to do it, when is it going to happen? Yeah, uh, you know, I understand. No, no, you, you, you don't. You um, you don't look at it that way. I'm like, what are you talking about? I don't look at it that way. It's a globe. Like, you can't have your cake and eat it too. Yeah. Oh God. I think uh, they lose the concept of uh, the umbrella effect of the firmament, and that the firmament is the round part. The flatness is the land which we stand on, which right. they lose the concept. Uh, half of it is round. Uh, and if we go to the bottom part of shield, you will see the other half of that round. So you really have to understand the concept in which the knowledge that we're trying to share with you when we're using these ancestral knowledge. Uh, even as we go to uh, the Hebrew cosmos, the sun is right in the clouds, uh, which verifies about 9,000, 10,000 feet. So when you say we have seen pilots flying over the sun, and you strike up this conversation with an average individual, they would swear that you're crazy. And so again, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so we have to always take that in consideration. Uh a lot of a lot of people would not graduate class on time, so everybody ain't gonna graduate the panel. Can I say something else? Let me say one no, thing. I, I, let me let me give a big shout out to Amber Glow. I want to say thank you so much, my sister, for becoming a member of this channel. Appreciate you. Go ahead. I'm sorry about that. Thank you so much. Hey, 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 hey. I realized the other day when I was looking up at the full moon, you know that circle that goes around the full moon sometimes? That's more proof of the dome, that it's a dome firmament because it reflects, it's so bright that it reflects in a, in a 360 degree off of the just like uh, just like rainbows, the reflection of the of the shape of the dome. That's what causes the rainbow to shape that way. You need a right a reflector hey. and light and moisture. Kind of. Yeah. I don't I don't know if you was. It's kind of was the transmission was a little, but check this out. Uh, uh, immortal errant, you said I always want to mute a nigga that got smoke. I tell you what you do, come up to the panel, bring your smoke, and if I mute you. Everybody, brother on this panel will call it out and say, Brother Sanchez, you just muted the man. Y'all y'all will moderate that, won't you, brothers? Yep. Yeah, we got you, bro. We got you. No, For real. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it right. Man. So, bring so it. there you go. Yeah. Now you don't have no excuse. Let's see if he still run. Because check it yeah. out. These brothers all going to cut in and say, All right, Sanchez, see? And I'm allowing it. And I'm allowing myself to be moderated. So there you go. <laughs> What's your excuse now? Let's get it. Well, you gotta think about that one. You guys think that's more uh, evidence of the dome permanent? When you walk into a dean of uh, 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 intelligent minds or so, when you walk into a dean of intelligent minds or so, we'll, we'll wait and see. <laughs> Nah, he won't do it. Ba, 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 ba. 
That'll be fire, though. I ain't gonna lie. If he do come I, I, up, I will have to drop him a bomb and, you know, give him his props, though. Yeah, we actually go. If, if you let him rock his theory for like uh, five minutes and then you can jump on it, like, you know, like give him, mm -hmm. give him a couple of time for free speech. Yeah. Let Even him get his pieces out. But, you know, but, you know, but, yeah. but, but, but once, once, once he be done, you know, just don't drop out of the call like you, like, like you con came concurred and, and did your thing, you know, stay there and wait for, for Sanchez to debunk you, you know, whatever you're going to say. We're not yeah. gonna interrupt you. We're just gonna let you slide. Yeah, and... like the, they, that's one of the <laughs> things. They come, they come to the panel, and then they be saying their shit, and then they be repeating it, and then they get mad with motherfucking Sanchez be muttering because he trying to debunk this shit. Why are you repeating it? He got it you, bro. Chill. Yeah. You feel me? Like niggas can just chill and listen, bro. Sometimes, bro. That's the only thing. Yeah, I mean, he's saying what I'm going to yeah, do we, instead of letting me do it first. Like, come on up, bro. You said you got to smoke, bro. Yeah. Yo, bro, Sanchez, he probably yeah. understand that you came from the streets of Shaolin. You got snake technique, the target technique. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but I'm not going to cut him off, though. I just uh -huh. want him to know, like, man, I'm going to let him rock. I'm going to let him go longer than five minutes. Fuck that. Right. Uninterrupted. Right. Yeah. You know? so let, let him, let he, maybe he doesn't have the, the, the scientific words to describe his theory. You know, we got to let him, let him, let his brain elaborate. <laughs> right, <laughs> right. We're going to scare him out. We're going to scare him out. Most of them come with know. other motherfuckers' theory. That's the only problem. <laughs> I think global. They can't global ever pick up a, a, a telescope or go go to the beach. You know what I'm saying? By themselves. They gotta is, be retarded if they haven't figured yeah, it out by now. Y'all see the poll, man? <laughs> My people <laughs> said, "Look, fuck that, Sanchez. Don't keep it moving. Get them haters to smoke. Ain't that some shit?" <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> y'all gonna make it hard for him, man. Oh man! <laughs> I don't really yeah. understand how people people still talk about all that globe and outer space shit. I'm tripping out. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with you? 2015 called. They want they want you to like you know do some homework. And shit. It's old school. It ain't a good day. It's like old school. We had a song. We ready? We ready? They ain't ready. I ain't ready at all. Like, all they gonna do, like, see, see what did he do? He mute me. That's right. the only thing they yeah. got. <laughs> the only thing they coming with. Hey, Sanchez, you know where else you could try this kind of uh, flat earth versus globe earth th uh, conversations? Uh huh. On tweet on Twitter, man. You open a, a a space and drop the link, and you will see. You will see a lot of people that will join because uh, oh, that that is a good idea. X, X is a platform that's getting all the all the they getting they more getting attraction bigger. than yeah. Facebook and Instagram. Yeah, they're getting really bigger. Mm -hmm. So you you're gonna you're gonna find a lot of a lot of people, even even the uh, NPCs from the small small hats crew trying to jump into the conversation and, and, and <laughs> go crazy, bro. I, I've been to some of the uh, flat earth discussion there with this guy, um, Caleb, and, and it gets really deep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, it's just. I don't understand, you know what I'm saying, how uh, Twitter, oh, I, I understand now because Elon is innovating. I think you can upload videos and shit to Twitter now, or X, I mean. You can do live and everything. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, you, can you, do live and, you can do yeah. live and have like a thousand people on, on your live and then have like 10 speakers on the on the chat room. 
right. on the same oh, life. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, yo, for real. No wonder Twitter growing. This is crazy. Yeah. I I really like, I, I got a question for a globalist that would like to join, right? And I always keep stuff simple. These are smoke plumes, right? Now we said that the earth is spinning a thousand miles per hour. Wouldn't these smoke plumes be making an L? You know, like a like a like a train with smoke coming out the top going down a track, it'll have an L because of the forward motion, it'll make an L, you know what I mean? But that that's what the globalist question for the globalist, not y'all. Y'all can carry on. Maybe that that'll get them up here, you know. Oh, bro, seriously, I've got to tell you too. So on on another on another little uh, chunk that was on, on TikTok, now they say because we use that one thousand miles per hour stuff. Now they're saying that's not that's that's wrong. Don't don't listen to that. Don't that 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 that's that's a wrong uh, calculation. And I'm like, oh, here we go. So not and, now, and you know when you just get to change the numbers on your shit, bro. You know right. it's some bullshit. <laughs> Man. You just get to change the numbers, right? Oh, it ain't this no you know, more. Is that, what like, the fuck? These are your people that that uh that that put it out there. These yeah, are your man. people who did the calculations. Yeah. Now you try to tell them that. Yeah. Hey, yo, bro, I got a question, right? I got a question. All right, how do they say that the atmosphere? How can the atmosphere be possibly like? I know you don't believe it, but from their standpoint, how does the atmosphere move? Because they say the reason why. Probably that smoke wouldn't move is because the atmosphere is moving with the earth. Like, how is that possible? Well, and then if, yeah, you to, if you go to the moon and you don't, you don't get that with the, the earth and the moon as a flying to miles an hour in space. I can't answer that either. Yeah, because so, they try to say it because you're on the earth. and But I mean, they don't even say that you're on the earth because they try to say that. Yeah, well, they do say that you're on the earth, but we say that there's no top on the earth. So, so they try to compare it into being inside of a car. And the reason why you don't feel yourself right. moving out of a car, but you're not sitting on top of the car. That's why. And the wind is not hitting you. That's right. why it's called a windshield. So, so that won't happen. See, see that, see, <laughs> see when they use that example like that, right? And, and then you tell them you put it on, you know, what if you sit on top of the car? But, but they, but they try to keep you inside of the car. Some, somehow they'll try to make your argument to keep you inside the car, but they won't. They won't stay on that outside of the car. They don't want to mess with that, you know. I mean, they they just have so many different ways of trying to connive you to stay in the car for for their, um, you know, for their uh, 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 uh what you call it? Their their, their um, they they make it seem like they, 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 we inside, they, we they their narrative. The their narrative. Like we yeah, the they say too. you're sitting on top yeah. of a. They say you're sitting on top of a ball, but yet you're inside of an atmosphere, which blocks right. the wind from outside from from hitting you at a thousand miles an hour. But yet yeah, you can fly to the moon and fly to Mars, and nothing right. is stopping you from going. Yeah, okay. Somehow we can break out the window that's keeping us from seeing a thousand miles an right. hour. You know what I mean? Somehow <laughs> we making it about the thing that's keeping. You know what I mean? I don't know, but you got yeah, yo guys, you got, I got another question, right? I got another question, right? Maybe this is simple. Maybe this is just not even a good good question, but I was wondering, right? All right, if the sun is in space, right? And mm -hmm. space is dark. How could something that powerful to bright up the whole solar system? Come on, without how does it not brighten up the own? Um, yes. How space? does how does how it how, how does it don't have a path from the sun to the thing that is illuminating a path of light where all right. of that darkness is illuminated, oh. leading to the thing? This is facts. That's facts, that man. Saying, they, look, listen. That's they fact. saying like some super, some some superficial force is taking the rays and transforming it into making it into light. It's like some bullshit. Yeah, it's yeah, a big bunch of. Let me give a shout out. Time. Awakening minds, flat motherfucking power. We said tetrahedron, hadron, collider, horn, bull. The paradox with the O and the X. Oh man, O and X, man and woman, the ops, duality. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I got you on that. That nigga there, yeah, boy. Bro. Hey. Bro, the fahedron is horned as well. The horned bull. The molecule, yeah. you know. Oh my bro. We this we will is build crazy, on that, bro. Cause I didn't even look at the word hedron is like horned. It's like, bro, this Man, is crazy. 
Yeah, yeah, my nigga. I've been one of the but we'll, we'll talk, bro. You know, I just be throwing a little shit. Then, we'll, we'll, we'll chop it up. Man, you know we gonna look, it's going down, man. It's going down. I'm I'm allowing um who is this? Nature to come on. Nature 4477. And then when you get on, right? Let us get a mic check and we can see what, what's good. But yeah, we're gonna keep it moving. Yeah, that just puzzles me, bro. Like, how can it be a big ball? If that sun is that powerful to make numbers like, how was the universe not lit lit up? But I don't understand that. Like that's something they gotta explain to me. Like I heard somebody explain it, but it still don't make sense how right. the sun is emitting light, but still you got it transforms into some type of ray, some energy, and then <laughs> atmosphere transfer it back, transform it back into light for the earth. That don't make no sense. The, like the whole space should be lit up. Right? The craziest part, the craziest part of the whole yes, right. space ideology to me was that they said was when they said that the 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 moon came from another rock hitting Earth, and that the moon is really a piece of the Earth from that from an asteroid that came and hit it from a long time ago. And it's like, you know, no matter how much you you know you could you could experiment for an entire lifetime, you can't throw two rocks together and break it and make a perfect circle. It just don't happen like that. It don't you know happen. I mean. So it's Back. like that, that's just impossible. It's not even probable. It's just not possible. They, they're trying to say that the earth after that happened, that the earth regenerated itself. That's why you don't see like the missing part from where the moon came back, it regenerated itself. So that's why you don't see that. But it's just like they try to tell like a little truth because they say that the moon it revolves around the earth, but the earth revolves around the sun. But it's really um it's both. It's like the earth and the um sun revolves around the earth on a flat. Well, Who's right, right. The sky is what moves. The sky is what moves. Who's Lapidus? What, what the sun is actually, it's just a little pinpoint of light, like a magnifying glass takes, because all the light is, is in the whole firmament. The whole firmament is lit up, but the sun is like the magnification point of the light, the focal right. point. Right. That's all it is. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Uh, who, who is Lapidus, guys? That's the dude that came with the global model, right? Lepithecus. Yeah, that's the dude that came out with the global model, right? That sounds no, like no, man. Oh, that's the that's Australopithecus. Oh. Yeah, that's the that's yeah, no, the damn monkey that the man. Human? Ain't that like the? <laughs> ain't that the? The, uh, that the, the genetic? Yeah, the genetic form the, of like the pre-human or some yeah, shit. Yeah, you got to know who that is, but that's the number one dojo right there, Lepithecus. That that's the oh, that's monkey. that monkey man. Okay, that's the monkey man. Or, or, or the or we should say monkey woman rather. Right. Lucy. Right. Oh, that's right. Lucy. Right. Lucy. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'll never forget. That's what I, that's what the deception started. So don't never forget that. Yeah, man. Nah, but Copernicus is important too because he's the one that started the globe Earth thing, right? Like, who was the first one to come up with the globe Earth? Because I know that was a Roman dude, right? That came up with it. That changed it from flat Earth to globe Earth. I don't know. I think right. you know, I think Copernicus is coined for, but I think that but that was like what like 1800, 1700. No, that was like 16. I don't know. It was like within the within the like the 15 to 1800s, and they, and they started pushing that shit back with like the Sumerians and shit. You know what I mean? They they try to say to the sun with the revolving around. They had the little tablet and shit with the dude. You know, y'all ain't ever seen that little Sumerian tablet where they try to say it's the sun and all the all the fucking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, rotating around. Yeah, they they've been doing that shit for thousands of years. So yeah, it's like heliocentrism. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Heliocentrism. Yeah. Now, honestly, bro, to like like that looked too new to me. That's like from my personal opinion, that that artifact, I just don't trust it. Like this is my personal opinion. I feel like it look it don't look ancient. It don't it's like it's too fresh to me. Like this is my personal opinion. I mean, it, it like, may, you know, you know, you may be right on that because they do be, you know, it's just it's just it's just a piece of evidence though. But you know, the the point is is that they've been doing it way before Copernicus, nigga. They've been trying to push this bullshit for a long time, and it ain't never, and it's hitting harder than ever now. So it's like, right, you know, at, at this point, niggas ready to just go to Mars, and it's like, you know, <laughs> and, and they'll do whatever the fuck to get there, like, you know, go out of body yeah. for. Yeah, another, another thing. That's that, that, that would be out of body. That, 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 that's oh, why they're creating all this AI shit, and and, and oh, they yeah. got this virtual reality and all that. Get get trying to get people to go into virtual reality, and then and and then like Bro Sanchez said one of his uh his um topics 
about going into the machine, man. <clears throat> Salute you know? everybody. Yeah, and uh, we gotta remember when, when they when they talk about stuff like like Mars and all this stuff that they ain't talking about up. They talking side to side. So when they say the the space force is real to keep you from going side to side endlessly. So who's to say that some of these locations they might got code names Mars or whatever? Like I said, it's all about the side to side motion that we can't are not allowed to do. And, and what I blew think, me I away, think. what blew me away was that stream, was that stream Sanchez did when he was showing Michio Kaku, that Asian scientist talking about laser porting and beaming right. motherfuckers to outer space. And it's like, and it's like, damn, and he, and he made a point saying that we've been paying these niggas billions, if not trillions of dollars for rocket ships, nigga. And cause oh. I, bro, I wanted to get on one of them motherfucking rocket ships, nigga. I swear to God I did, bro. I wanted to go my so bad, bro. You know what I, was, I mean? I was, Coming over here to this platform really humbled the nigga. Like, you know what I mean? I wanted to be that nigga. So it was like, to see Michi Okaku talking about laser port and we're not taking yeah, rockets. Yeah, yeah. We're going to have to beam you number. up to outer that space. Kaku, dude, like, that Kaku, with me being the older guy, right? I'm in my 50s now. That Kaku dude did a number on us, man. That's a line. Oh, my God. Bro. Man, bro. That was Had my favorite back in the day. Crab, crab nebula. We did the crab nebula and all yeah. types of yeah. Yeah. planets and stuff. Yeah. 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 Hey, they did a sin, bro. They did a Damn. Oh, look. Real truth, we might have a background. Uh, somebody background. Somebody got a background there. Somebody got the YouTube going in the background. They got to go ahead, Real Truth. Well, I was going to say, man, son, um, a lot of people, you know, no matter how smart they get, bro, you know, you try to introduce them to Flat Earth, they just don't want to deal with it, bro. And that's why I'll be saying sometimes, um, you know, you just got to pay attention. You got to listen. And I'll direct them to you, bro. You know, uh, I've had a couple of people say they didn't like your delivery or they didn't like this and like that. And I said, well, I'm going to tell you something for real. I was like, I don't care what you don't like about your teacher. If they got them lessons and it's a, and it's a test that you need to pass, bro, you just need to put all that aside. And pay attention, get the jewels, you know, eat the fruit and spit the seed out. And But you know what, real truth? They will complain yeah. about my delivery and defend yeah. rap music and hip hop. And they don't care that them rappers be saying they'll hit your grandma. They can fuck your mama. You ain't on my level. You, you're broke as hell, nigga. You don't speak my language. They'll buy that nigga's album. They don't say, man, your delivery too rough to your fans, man. You know, they ain't got it you like know why that. Why you stunting on you them? Know you know why we don't understand that, Sanchez? Because we think outside the box. They don't know what the hell to think. That's why they think that way. They don't even know what to think, bro. That's some hypocritical shit right there. Oh, well, I don't like this. You ain't got to like this about everybody. But, you know, if if, if this man dropping them jewels, man, you better go get them, bro. That's all I'm going to tell you because your reality has been stolen from these people. All right? And I don't, I don't see nobody else out here. They, yes. They, they, a person mm -hmm. only complain about your delivery when you telling them the truth because the truth hurt. Yep. Yep. It really does. Yep. Yep, yep. I remember, I remember. I remember when I moved from. Uh, I graduated from school in '92, so I'm telling my age. I'm 52, right? I remember I moved up north. Man, they were calling me all kinds of country. Talk <laughs> 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 right? They, they they used to kill me, but 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 look, the girls used to love that shit. They be like, talk for me again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that country has it, boy. Them niggas used to be mad at me, son. Then I used to come back down south, you know, after some years, and I'm talking like a little bit up north, and the guy. Then the girls love that shit too. So, but yeah, man, that delivery shit, man. They they just need to open these, man, and close that, man. Maybe they'll learn something. Sanchez, mm -hmm. I, I see now that the people voting for me to go ahead, I might have to. Yeah, I'm gonna have that two. <laughs> at, you know what? At, at, at the two hour mark, or maybe. 
You know what, man? I might just go on ahead over here to sit down with Sanchez and give bro this smoke, review this video. What y'all want to do? Now, what I'm going to do, Let's right? Go. I'm going to leave this panel open, but y'all go, you know, I'm going to review it and shit. It, 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 you know, that's 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 what I think I want to do because the people voted. So th this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to, um, yeah, fuck it. Let me go on ahead and, and, and smoke real quick. I ain't going to end this one yet. I'm going to end it in the next, like, 10 minutes, and we're going to head over to the sit down and strike back on these haters, man. Y'all voted for it. <laughs> hey, do we, have to, do we have to switch channels or just stay here? Nah, well, yeah, you just, you just go over, go over to the sit down with Bro Sanchez. I mean, I'm going to switch say, channels, but I'm going to keep this call open. If you on this call, you cool. If you in the okay. chat room watching, go to my other channel, sit down with Sanchez. Right. I need a B, Sanchez. I ain't got no B. I'll, I'll grow something up to it. Hey Marcel, how old, how old are you, Marcel? You muted. I'm fifty three. Oh, fifty two. I'm an Eminem too. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Where were you at? I, I got I, I got you by five years. <laughs> Stop lying, dog. You ain't no damn. <laughs> Seven, bro. My, my, my bad. I can't count. Damn. <laughs> I, I I lost the number. Six six years. Got that by six years. God damn, boy. What you eating, <laughs> bro? Hey, you got some new shit back in about two years. Did y'all check the hey, chat? How long y'all been, uh, how long y'all been, um, uh, with the Flat Earth, man? Hey, can y'all uh, check the chat, bro? I put some new info in the chat for y'all. Okay. Go ahead, OG. Yeah, tell, tell us. Who's tell that? Tell that? Tell I'm going to open the floor to OG first. Go ahead, OG. Since he's the oldest, go ahead. No, nah, I'm saying, um, yeah, man, dude, I'm so pissed off every time I think about it, man, because I started when I was 51, man. I mean, I wish I could have had this shit when I was in my 20s. Man, I would have yeah, yeah. probably have you. I would have opened up a church. I would have a goddamn church, man. <laughs> he's a flat he's a all in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I would have, man. Oh, what? For real, though. <laughs> Hey, yo, it, it's talk. people right now, they don't even know, listen, there's people right now, they don't even know this eclipse is coming. I was just talking to this lady, uh, how old is she, about 63? She said she never seen the eclipse. Wow. wow. I was really? like, I tried to explain it to her. I'm like, look, you know, information that we be learning over here, man, it's going to help you. It's going to help you. Uh, uh, that thing they say, uh, um, yeah, the truth hurts, but it'll set you free. Yeah, right? sure. it's all yeah. these lies that they told, and then you're gonna be able to see your true reality to help you understand who you are, what you really are, and what this place really is. It's beautiful to understand this information, man. This shit gives you good already. Yeah, it gives uh, you intellect, man. It gives you real intellect. It's intelligence, and you can only get that from the most, from the truth. You know what I'm saying? Right. Let me right. let me tell you about it. Huh? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, make sure you guys find out what. Wait, who was that? Yeah, check it. Make that was, sure you guys that was find me out awakening what, mind. That sorry, was man. Salutes, but do speaking now. But you good though, my nigga. Y'all go ahead. Oh, and my bad, my bad. Yeah. Oh, I just, I just want to tell you about the two poisons uh, that led me to my flutter. Uh, the blood that covered me, and uh, where was I? So I asked these questions. I was like 38. Uh, so I've been like. Flat Earth now for like six years, mm -hmm. and uh, so uh, been in and out. So what happened was I ended up going in to a lot of public issues. You know, understand? So I come back and kept the communication along the line with the body, which was amazing to go in with the concept that I have now in mm -hmm. a Christian on a Christian based society. And even though I may have touched one or two people. I'm satisfied with that because I know that this flat earth stuff is so real. Bro. The ancestral knowledge is like the ancestors were talking to me at night, bro. And I'm just so thankful, bro, to have brothers that uh that I can relate Man, to. Man, I'm not satisfied that it ain't no smoke up there. But <laughs> right. respect myself, respect. It ain't not because it ain't no smoke. Hey, look, I got something better than smoke. I got something better than smoke, man. We got to talk about Terra Infinita, y'all. 
We got to talk about Terra Infinita, man. And that's that's where they hiding all the lands at. That's where that's the new map right now that's showing the lands beyond Antarctica. Uh-huh. I saw it. Oh, I yeah, saw yeah, it. yeah. We, we know about that. Uh-huh. Hey, I didn't yeah. know, since all this stuff is popping out, they trying to like throw us off or something or because yeah. you know right. they want you to know something, right. they'll let you see that shit. You know what I'm saying? But but the thing about right. Sanchez, nah. they can't just put out what he <laughs> teach. He actually gotta teach you. He actually gotta he pulled the proof out to show you uh to make you understand, like he show you the symbolism. Like they just show you a bunch of pictures, like like all these circles outside of this circle over here. <laughs> Like, they could be fooling you, ass for real. Yeah, I, 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 hey, I, I, I feel that. I feel that, bro. I feel that too, bro. I want. I, I want to tell you guys about well, some real quick. Well, secret, no lads. We're gonna get out of here right now, unfortunately. Um, but you can meet us uh, over on the sit. That well, actually, you can say what you want, man. But I'm just letting them know I'm about to close this show. But the call is open. You can holler at the callers. Um, but hold on, though. Let me close out real quick, secret. Um. Yeah, to everybody that sent in a super chat cash app for this show, man, I appreciate y'all for sponsoring this uh, program. I'm going to head on over to the sit down and I'm going to give y'all some more content because y'all voted for it. And I appreciate everything y'all do as well. Lowrider, Lowrider NC, thank you for this end of stream super chat, my brother. Flat motherfucking power. Appreciate that right. love, my bro. And, um, yeah, I'm about to I'm about to close this out. 